Hello and welcome to today's video where I'll be showing you how to get the Wagga Worm and the Taeyulong. Now, the Wagga Worm is the new event creature for the Valentine's Day event for the, this year in Creatures of Scenario. So, first I will show you how to show you the creature and then I'll show you how to get it. So this is the Wagga Worm. It's a pretty cool little dude. Um, he can fly. He's very adorable. But um, here is his walking animation, his sprinting animation, his flying animation, his um Z animation, his X animation, his sitting, and his laying animation. And it also here is his rolling in mud animation. Pretty cool, so let's check out his stats. Now, the Wagga Worm is a small flying herbivore, and it has the 1,500 health, does 71 damage, its stamina is 118, it weighs 1,530 pounds, its walk speed is 20, its sprint speed is 111, and its fly speed is 45. So this pr creature is pretty good. Now let's hop into how to get him. Now for the um Wagga Worms um missions, I'm going to be using the Karakro, but you can um use any fast flying creature. So the first mission is to break a hundred chocolate piles. So now I will show you the method I use. I use to get a hundred of them fast. So you want to be on Flower Cove, and we're going to start at the pond here. So you go here, then you take this box, and then you take the next one, which is here. And I will speed up the rest of the process, but um, feel free to slow it down so you can see it. And that is all of the chocolate boxes on this island. Now, let's see if you go around here. The one at the start has already loaded back in. So, it is a very good method to use to just grind it. I grinded it for maybe 30 minutes, and I got all of them. So now, for the second quest, Hatch 5 players is a medium or higher um, flying creature. Now, that's why I also picked the Karakro, because if you nest as it for five times you will um, have this mission done, which is very simple and very easy. So, and the final one is eat 500 food. So, I would recommend when you're doing the chocolate box quest to wait until your creature has a very low um, hunger so that you can get a lot of it really fast and see it goes up pretty fast this is also why i picked the karak rope because if there's no grasses around you can, you can use the area food restore to restore any plants or bushes that are around that have been stripped of all their food so yes um and just that from 30 percent to 100 percent has given me quite a bit. Um, once this is done, I'll show you how much it's given me. It has given me a lot of um food, and that's just from thirty to a hundred percent once. So yes, that is what I would say is the best method to get the Wagga Worm. So let's hop on to the next creature. So this is the Taeyulong. Now the Taeyulong is a pretty cool, I think it's Chinese dragon creature, and that is because um Chinese New Year is sometime at this week, I am pretty sure. So that is pretty cool. And pretty cool looking 
dragon so let's go on to his animation so this is his walking animation his sprinting animation his flying animation where he kind of um just floats around <laughs> really um his sitting his laying his rolling in mud animation his aggro animation that's pretty cool he flies up into the air whoa he is cower animation so yeah let's check out his stats so the Taeyulong is a medium sized carnivorous flyer at this stage at 80 percent he has um two 1,800 health, his damage is 96, his stamina is 104, he weighs 3,078 pounds, his walk speed is 36, his sprint speed is 82, and his fly speed is 40, which is pretty good for um, a creature. So, now I will show you how you get it. I'm going to stay as this creature because he is in the timed missions section so you will need to have 25 percent of all species owned which is not that difficult um you will need to log in at least seven unique times so this is all of this month you'll have to log in seven times which is pretty easy um spin session or boosted gacha a total of five times i would recommend the boosted gacha because it's a lot cheaper um and recycle 30 species into tickets in your inventory. I've already done seven, and that's just been today. So yeah, it's not that difficult. If you save up your time points, you can, um, for a lot, you can um, get a lot of it pretty fast. And that's, you still have all of this month to go, which is quite a bit, because we're not even halfway through this month. So yes, this is pretty cool. Um... Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.